Hello again, you delightful creatures. In this gameplay video, I'm gonna be showing you three things that are, I think are quite cool. Firstly, how to manually eject from a Titan. Secondly, how to wall hang. And thirdly, how to hack a Spectre so that the Spectre works for you. Three things that I didn't find out until fairly recently. So I thought that perhaps you'd enjoy uh, watching them. You might already know how to do all these three things. I didn't until recently, so I thought to myself, hey, maybe these guys don't know how to do it as well. I'll show them if that's the case. Uh, three pretty cool things. Uh, I'll show you the wall hang first because that's just really easy to do. Uh, I'll then show you how, how to hack a spectre, but before I can do that, I need to actually find a spectre. So that might take a little while. And then when I acquire a titan, I'll show you how to manually eject and fuck shit up as it were. So let's just show you how to wall hang first. This is really simple to do, but a lot of people don't know how to do it. So what you need to do is basically jump to a wall and hold the left trigger button and you just kind of hang on the wall. Now you can only hang for a certain amount of time and you can shoot and after a while you just automatically drop. So you simply jump, press the left trigger button and you hang on the wall. And you can shoot from here. You can't zoom because you're obviously using the left trigger to, to hang. So that's that can be quite useful. I can imagine that being oh shit useful in a fair few situations. Uh, not there, of course, because I just got done over. But I'm kind of just showing you guys what to do. So let's try it one more time. Booyah. Hang from the wall. Marvellous. So now what I'm going to try and do is find a spectre and hack it. Because let me take this dude out first. Wow, that was some very bad shooting. But yeah, I'm going to try and find a spectre. One of those little robots, robot enemy bots. And uh, hack it, because it's, it's quite a cool hack animation. Plus, it works for you, so that's quite cool as well. These are just like... So yeah, it's going to be, it might be quite hard to f actually find a spectre. Uh, maybe I can equip one of my burn cards and that'll help me. So let me equip a burn card. So let me go with uh, Echo Vision. This shows me where everything is on the screen. So here, here we go. This could be quite useful. See, oh, actually this is a really useful burn card because you can actually see, you can see where everyone is. And the orange skeletons indicate enemies, blue skeletons indicate uh, friendly uh, dude. So let's see if I can find a spectre. Well, oh, this is really useful, actually, isn't it? Awesome. So I'm not going to equip a titan just yet because I still want to try and find a spectre. But this is a really useful burn card, actually. First time I've used this burn card, and as you can see, I managed to get an assassination. Oh, there's like a dude there. Let's see if I can, uh... find a spectre using this burn card. Okay, here we go. There's some enemy AI here. No. Got taken out. This is, it just adds a whole... Okay, got taken out. Try still trying to find uh, an enemy spectre to hack. Well, let's try and f this dude over in the process. Why not? Eh? Ah, he equipped Titan Electrical Smoke, which f'd me up. Okay, let's let's get a Titan in here. Oh fuck, I just fucked over a titan. That's <laughs> sweet. I just dropped my titan onto another titan by complete accident. But that was fucking cool nonetheless. Um, I'm quite lucky to have caught that because I've never done, actually done that before and that was just through sheer luck. So you can actually do that. You can drop your titan onto another titan and fuck them up like I just did there, which is quite fun. I'm still trying to find... 
Oh, could these? No, these are just... Oh, shit, here we go. So, there we go. Here's a spectre. This is a bit of luck. So, this is how you hack. Oh, no, no, fucking no. There we go. You go behind them, you press X, and you actually hack the enemy spectre. So, now this guy is on my team. So, it's quite a cool hack animation. Plus, he now works for me. And there you go. So, that was pretty cool. Uh, so, that's hack. So now I'm going to show you how to manually eject from your Titan. Believe it or not, some people don't actually know how to do this, but... So let's try and do this. Someone tried to land their Titan on me by the looks of it. No, they didn't. That was my own teammate. So you can actually manually eject from your Titan. And if you've got the nuclear, nuclear eject... Uh, perk equipped. It r it can really do some damage. I'll do it now. Here we go. So you press up on the D-pad. You can manually eject, and nuclear explosion takes out everything below you. So that's how you manually eject. You press up on the D-pad, and then manually eject that way. And that way you can cause some pretty extensive damage. So let's try another burn card while I'm here. Ghost Squad, this permanently cloaks you as a pilot. So that's pretty useful. So I'm now permanently cloaked. Let's see how much damage I can do with this before being taken out. Hopefully some. Let's find some higher ground. There we go, no. And try and find some dudes to take out here. So... Showed you how to do quite a bit in this video, but you might have already known how to do all this shit anyway. But hopefully, you f might have found this useful if you didn't know how to do that stuff. Let's try and uh, get on this dude. Hopefully, take this guy out. So he's permanently doomed, took out a titan, that was pretty cool. Let's see if I can assassinate this dude. Took him down too. Didn't quite get the assassination animation though. So yeah, again, it's quite useful having permanent cloak. It really does help. So some of the burn cards are really effing useful. Uh, allow you to do some pretty cool stuff. But yeah, you can have some pretty hectic games. Whoa, nuclear explosion. This game can be fucking insane at times, I have to say. But it's a hell of a lot of fun. Let's drop in a Titan. Oh. Took him off. He tried to rodeo my pilot. Sorry, he tried to rodeo a Titan and I took him out, which is pretty cool. So, we have to now try and destroy the uh, dropship. Let's see if we can do that as well. That'll be an awesome end to the video if we can actually mess up the. Uh... Fuck. I'm getting taken out from many different angles. Shit. This is fucking chaotic. Okay, let's see if I can nuclear explode these bitches. I think I was just fucking up my own Titan there. But I've still got that I've still got that um burn card equipped where I'm permanently Let's see if we can take out the dropship. I don't think we're going to be able to. No, we can't. We didn't have enough firepower to take it out. So there you go. You kind of saw how to wall hang by pressing the left trigger whilst you're on a wall. Uh, you saw how to hack a spectre. You go up behind them. You press X. You hold down X. You get your knife out and that hacks them. The spectre then works for you. Uh, you saw a few cool burn cards. You saw how to manually eject. If you want to manually manually eject from your Titan, you press up. 
Um, let me just show you that uh, if I go to Titan Loads Out and Custom, if you go into Tier 1, I believe, there we go, Tier 1, and you have Nuclear Ejection. After you eject, your Titan briefly charges and then detonates its nuclear core. And if you want to do that manually, you just press up on your D-pad and then hit the X button, and you do that. So you saw quite a few things in this video. I hope you enjoyed it. It wasn't a, quite as bad as some of the previous <laughs> Titanfall gameplay videos I've had. Uh, so if you enjoyed that, give it a thumbs up. And thanks for watching, you effing glorious creatures. Goodbye, sirs and madams.